Hi, welcome back from Galaxy Note 3 Root.com for this week's Exynos model of the Note 3, the one with SM uh, N900 model number. Um, go ahead and check out the latest version of Lee Droid ROM. Now, I've used this ROM uh, on um, some of my other Galaxy phones, older Galaxy phones, uh, and the developer of this ROM, XEA user Lee Droid, has been making some excellent mods uh, for many of the uh, Android open source stuff. Um, he's an excellent developer and I know he's actually not been making a ton of ROMs but um, this is one of his later, uh, latest versions and uh, he's been actually making some ROMs uh, as of last couple uh, iteration of Galaxy phones and I highly recommend his work. Um, this is the Lee Droid ROM obviously and uh, let me go ahead and show you uh, one of the coolest things about his ROM is that um, He's got uh, some really cool stuff like Theme Manager here. Um, you'll get all of these different uh, themes uh, for free. And new ones being added. Uh, so let's actually go check them out. Um, you'll see the toggles there, which is right now I have the Galaxy S5 theme. And let me go ahead and show you what uh, some of the other stuff looks like here. Um, so I've downloaded uh, Windows 8. And uh, his themes are really complete, um, you know. And I think what he did is actually take some of the stuff from my UI themes uh, and implement it into his ROMs. As you can see, I've got a complete Windows 8 theme here, uh, along with uh, all Windows 8 uh, icons there for the toggles. Uh, even the screen has changed for the lock screen. Uh, so very nice stuff, and you'll have almost about, I think about 21 themes right now. Now that's not all of it. You can even get a bunch of battery icons. Um, you know, some of this in, in Chinese, and I think XA developer Lee Droid is actually Chinese, uh, and I think he's actually more active with the Chinese forums. Um, that's why we don't probably not seeing some of this stuff. Uh, but excellent stuff, battery icons, and you can get uh, icon packs. These are all free, uh, as you can see. A ton of stuff you can download. Even if you don't change the theme, you can get a bunch of icons we can, which can completely change um, your UI look. So definitely nice stuff. Uh, some more weather, which is there. So that is the uh, Lee Droid uh, theme manager. And also this is a modded um, TouchWiz launcher. And you can see, I can bring up the um, a task manager there. And uh, there's also Lee Droid settings, which you can mess with here. Um, you can change the status bar colors. Um, this is what I actually found uh, Lee Droid because um, the Lee Droid always makes these really nice custom toggles and uh, he lets everybody else, all the other developers, ROM developers, to use it for free, um, which I think is great. You know, it's just uh, how open source should work. And you can change it back to official, but um, it's going to look kind of boring. Uh, the, why, the reason why it didn't change because I have a new theme. And I think I have to actually go back to um, the default theme here. And uh, you'll see that once I go back to the default theme, um, you will be able to see the original toggles there. Uh, so that's what it was. And let me go ahead and change it back to the Lee Droid. I think it looks so much better with the blue. Um, and also you can easily uh, change your buttons, uh, change the button order using this here. Um, also, you have a memory cleaner widget. Um, this can kind of clear out memory quickly. Also, very useful stuff. If you need the network speed, um, if you don't want it, you can go ahead and unclick it. Uh, of course, you got the CPU uh, load widget. This is great. Um, some apps now these days, they might be mining Bitcoins, Dogecoins, um, you know, secretly. And this will help you see uh, if there's any apps using a lot of data or a lot of CPU power. Um, sort of like a good thing to have, um, you know, aside from that, you know, also for other apps. Also for phone, you can do um, auto re uh, call recording. And of course, this ROM does have call recording. Um, torch on lock screen, go ahead and long press the home button and you'll get torch. Uh, so very nice stuff there. And when you unlock, uh, it does not, it's not going away. <laughs> but you can go ahead and turn it off um, using your button or you can go ahead and uh, redo the torch um, button from the lock screen. A pen window, you can add your favorite apps. Um, this one is actually pen, not pen window manager. Um, Lidro had actually 
built his own pen window here so you can go ahead and add your favorite apps which I think is neat um, you know when you use apps it's great but you know you get more ads um, you know this is a lot more integrated so you don't have to be running a separate app um, so very nice stuff other than that uh, did I forget anything today um, looking pretty good oh also this is a 5x5 five five touch with launcher um, ah. there we go so 5x5 five five. a little bit bigger than the stock I think 4x5 um, so definitely nice uh, stuff to have overall it is another great ROM you know I'm not saying this is the best ROM there's no such thing as best ROM I mean there is best ROMs for beginners that's what I have on my site so you can check that out uh, also not for beginners but just ROMs that can kind of get you off the ground uh, buck free great performance great battery life um, that's what I consider a good ROM not necessarily the one that has a ton of features uh, but this is a great ROM very stable great performance great battery life so definitely check it out for this week's ROM of the week Lead Droid ROM um, you will probably hear this ROM again and again as new phones come out so definitely try it out at least once if you have a SMN 900 and do let me know when you, what you think and as always if you have a Note 3 uh, don't forget to subscribe to my email list at galaxynote3root.com sorry that's just my AT&T back cover on my SM N900 that's not an AT&T Note 3 anyway see you guys later uh, have a great day and thanks guys for watching my video if you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and the subscribe button below here uh, to get more cool ROM reviews tips tricks and more and also check out video of the week over here if you haven't yet and as always I uh, stay <coughs> on Android.